15 Really two big questions marks here for this match, Sam. One is Sampras' fitness after five matches here, four matches, I'm sorry, in the U.S. Open. And the other one, Mr. Roddick's foot. Wide and Pete Sampras begins this match holding at love. One thing that I've wondered, Nico, is how Roddick would approach this match in terms of, of the crowd. He feeds off an American crowd so much. 134. Sampras has just been too good. Sampras strikes first. He gets the break and he leads two love. been all Pete Sampras to start this match. A lot of tennis yet to be played, but at the moment, Sampras in control of three love. Sigh of relief from Andy Roddick. It's his first game as we see his coach. Sampras holds serve despite not getting credit for his seventh ace. Sampras ahead 5 2 in this final quarterfinal match. has taken the opening set six games to three. Sharp to start the second set. Ooh, that was ugly. What's going on there, Nico? I mean, those are three very makeable volleys. back on that side and Sampras with the benefit of that overall settles down and holds 3-1. The way Sampras is serving Roddick can hold it love all he wants especially in this set and Sampras has the break and he's up 3-2.
that but he is picking up those half hours of his feet unbelievably well. So good. Well Sampras stays ahead of break here in the second set. Roddick with only one ace with a serve that big you'd expect him to have more. Drop shot there by Sampras. And now Roddick has just given Sampras another opportunity. And he's done it. And that just about gives the second set to Pete Sampras, much to the delight of his wife. He will serve for the second set. Of two breaks of serve. Well, he just has all the answers tonight. Pete Sampras is out in front by two sets. He's one set away from the semifinals. This match is by no means over. No, not at all. Now you've got that potential that Ronick has. And Sampras has got a break of serve in the opening game of the third. Good way to finish it off, give him a little confidence. Just his third ace in this match. And his first game of the third set. Sampras in control of the match. There we go. He knows who's the boss. <laughs> He will not invite him to play in the exhibition <laughs> after he retires. Yeah. And he does it. Keep in mind, Sampras last year being the first man in U.S. Open history to beat three former champions in consecutive matches. with an ace. A little bit of a fist pump. Cypress won here in 90, 93, 95, and 96. Joel works in the tennis academy where Andy Roddick practices now. Oh, unbelievable pickup. Sampras is sweetness tonight. Sampras holds it love. He's two games away from the semifinals. Is that attitude because of the way he's been playing tonight? He's built up so much confidence, but Andy Roddick doesn't go away. He's not dead yet. Sampras up a break. He'll be serving it 4-3. Chooses the right spot. And Roddick gets in front. And at this point, he'd see a break point. Not tonight, says Sampras. <laughs> 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 
And Sampras holds serve. cold serve but it's Pete Sampras who will have a chance to close out the match and get back to the semifinals of the U.S. Open. The match rests on the racket with Pete Sampras and his serve. Oh, and the Roddick with a good backhand cross court. And now match point for Pete Sampras. That will do it. He's answered those questions tonight. Pete Sampras will play in the semifinals of the U.S. Open. A straight set victory over Andy Roddick. How about that?